the first thing you're going to know is just how small this room is. And I'm going to get start off with some little pointers, so you'll notice that when I started filming this, this was actually at night. We got into the next morning because I wanted to actually try the room out so I can give you an accurate representation of what the room is all about, so I can do that. So, first thing to note is the room is incredibly small. Not only is it small, it's incredibly thin with the walls as well, so you pick up a lot of background noise, people walking past. I think it's wooden floorboards below, so you hear people walking past. So this was carried on well through to 11 o'clock, through to midnight before the park opened. The park opened obviously at 10 o'clock, so you get people staying up uh, till 11, 12 o'clock, so you end up hearing a lot of background noise. So that's something for you to be prepared for if you are staying here. And when you first come in, you start thinking, actually, things aren't too great. You realise just how small the room is, there's not much room to navigate, there isn't a lot to do in here. Uh, and so you start thinking, oh, you hear a lot of background noise and things happening, you realise how loud it is. If you're staying at the bottom, you realise just how loud it is with people above you as well. Uh, and it kind of puts you off and it makes you think, oh, where am I staying? Now, I'm going to the good points now, because when, when I've stayed here, I've given it a good chance and so I know what it's all about. First thing to note is the air conditioning. When you're staying here in summer, it's actually fantastic once you figure out how to work it. Air conditioning is just by the double bed. We're staying in a family room here. This is a double room. Your air conditioning is just there. And that orange button is the on-off button. You're able to alter your air conditioning there. And I will add, the air conditioning, fantastic work. It was incredibly cold. Some people don't like it cold, some people do. I do. I loved it. Ended up having a fantastic night's sleep. I wanted to rate the hotel one or two out of five, but once I've had that good night's sleep, and literally, if I weren't staying here for four parts, to go and stay and look at the roller coasters, in actual fact, I'd uh, probably give it now a four, because I had a great night's sleep and it was fantastic. I really didn't want to get up, if I'm completely honest. So I managed to get a good night's sleep. Now the bed looks a bit slutty and I apologise because I've slept in it and I will make it in a moment but it is comfy, you get two cushions, I'll just move on down here you also get a little blanket there that you're able to use you've got a television just up there, television isn't great I think you have to log in on the Wi-Fi and you're able to watch things that have Jaws on there ironically, staying at the Sharp Hotel nice theming just there you've got a bunk, so if you're staying with kids it seems it's going to be a maximum of two kids you've got a top bunk just up there and you have bottom bunk just down here. Size doesn't look too brilliant, but for small kids, probably don't make much difference. You might be wondering why there's balloons. Well, it was my birthday while I stayed here, and my girlfriend did request something for my birthday. So, nice little touch for him to wish me a happy birthday. You get a couple of bottles of complimentary bottled water. That's to use for the kettle because you've got tea and coffee facilities. These are our own Kindle ones. You don't get them for free, but we're just leaving them here. Your bin you find just down there. You've got some hangers, towels. Three drawers just here, here, and here, and then you get the bathroom which we've opened up. Sorry it's a bit condensated, I've just had a shower, but uh, yeah, here's your bathroom, so you've got your toilet just there, bathroom there, you've got some towels, good sized towels just in there. I've heard people moaning about water running from the shower, so I just had a quick shower and it didn't run too bad as you can see, which is good, and the shower, all in all, is actually quite good. So it's not, you've got a mirror just here, it's not too bad a place really to, to stay in my opinion one little note you got see this little circle here I think it might be condensated on the window it is I'll just wipe it quickly and then it's a little bit of light in you have a window just here which this can just hook off like that so that's been the video I hope you enjoyed the video if you did enjoy this video make sure you leave a thumbs up let me know your thoughts in the comments below make sure you subscribe if you're new around here and stay tuned for more videos, so I'll see you then, so from JSGC, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day, go check out my social media links which you can find in the description below, I'm popping up on the screen, and I'll see you all again for the next video. Have a nice day, peace, ciao for now. <laughs>